See an event like this uh, shows you just how much interest there is in the uh, in Chesterfield's appearance in the final of the Johnson's Paint Trophy. Yeah, it's nice. Um, obviously, very humble by it. Um, all season, the, the fans have been great home and away for us. It's nice to give us something to cheer about at Wembley. It's a dream. Dream, just a dream because in, in France I see a lot of games in Wembley when the friends play against uh, England or so Anel Carsco twice. For me, uh, Drogba score in Wembley. Uh, a lot of players uh, have been players so to replay, uh, Nasri play in Wembley. So for, for, for a young French, it's a dream to play Wembley. It's amazing. And I, I, I can't believe it now I go to Wembley, so just I hope, uh, I hope um, we play well in Wembley and take the, the cup. What, uh, what sort of reaction do you get from fans when you're driving around? Well, it's just people ootering, screaming at the coaches. You know, every coach that goes past, everyone's knocking on the windows and showing the backsides and things. It's, it's just a good laugh. He's had his head cut now. It's been excellent, Nick. We've had a, a paint the town blue day all across Chesterfield today, culminating here in the market hall this afternoon. Everyone's got into the spirit of it. It's really galvanised the community, and I think everyone's now ready to go to Wembley. Down, your hands up and have no doubt. Good evening, Rob Staten on BBC Radio Sheffield, and welcome to the Proac Stadium for a football heaven special. Yeah. 